Hi, welcome to Code Club. My name is Miss Laura and I am a Community Services Librarian at the Grundy Library. This is our first Code Club of August. Can you believe it's August already? And for this one, we're going to have some more fun. Last week, Miss Amber took you through a bunch of different Harry Potter exercises because as you know, the end of July, the 31st, is Harry Potter's birthday. So yay, happy birthday Harry Potter that happened last week. This time we're going to be having some fun with Minecraft. So last month I had a Bloxels club and we learned how to use blocks to build video games. And that's essentially what Minecraft is. So today we're gonna go to code.org. So up in your browser, if you go to code.org, and then once you're there, we're going to hit the learn tab. And as we go down, you're going to see that um, we have hour of code. So one of the very first ones here is Minecraft and that's the one we're going to choose today. So this is going to build off of scratch and you get to have a choice. So you have a Minecraft voyage, you can do a hero's journey, you can do an adventurer challenge, or you can do a designer challenge. The one I'm going to choose is this Minecraft adventurer challenge. So this is good if you're fairly new to Minecraft or if you didn't get very far, um, because it's going to show you the code behind the actions that you actually do within the game. If you want more of a challenge, if you've done a lot of Minecraft, then maybe you want to do one of the other three. Um, it's up to you, but I'm going to show you on this Minecraft adventurer. All right, we're going to hit start. So once here, as you can see, we have a number of different tutorials. My name is Jens Sperjensten, but I'm better known as Jeb. I'm the so this is a video that's going to explain to you what you need to do. If you don't want to watch the video, that's fine. You can figure it out on your own. There are instructions on the page. They also have notes here. So if you can't watch the video or the video isn't working for you, you can utilize this here. All right, so I'm gonna click out of this and now we get to choose a character. So I'm gonna be Alex because I like her red hair. So now it's giving us our instructions. So we need to move forward so we can reach the sheet block. If you look here, there's additional instructions that you can have in case you need it. So now we have a very similar um, grouping as like we did with regular Scratch, where we have the game over here to the left, we have our blocks that we can utilize, and then we have our workspace. When we're finished adding our code here, we can select Run or Reset depending on what part of the instructions we're working on. So I'm going to say we have her right here. They already have one move forward, but if you notice, there's still two blocks. So I'm gonna add one more move forward. Make sure that clicks in place with that little click noise, and then we can run. Ta-da! We have solved our first puzzle. Good job. You have now written two lines of code. So we're gonna continue and go to the next challenge. In this challenge, it says we have wood is a very important resource. So we're going to need to go up to the tree and then we're going to destroy it so we can gather the wood. So where we're at, she's facing the correct direction. So then we have one, two blocks. So we're going to add two move forwards. And then we can destroy the tree. In other words, chop it down. Now we're going to run. Ta-da! We heard our little silver tinkle bells, which means that we completed exercise two. So that's all the exercises I'm going to show you in this particular challenge. I want you to finish up the rest, and if there's something that you built or something that you had fun with or added to these games, please feel free to share your images on Facebook or on Instagram. We would love to see them. Just make sure you tag Grundy Library. So guys, I hope you have an awesome August and Miss Amber will see you in two weeks and I will say bye for now. Thank you so much. Have a great day.